my magic pet Morphle can morph into anything I want. have no color, just like me. Aha! <laughs> uh -huh. So you're the one who has been stealing all the color from the city. You shouldn't do that. A world without color isn't fun at all. for you. There are lots of problems in the city because you took away all the colors. Morphle can help Chroma paint everything back to its original colors again. Hi there. Somehow our fire truck lost its color. Morphle and Chroma can help you with that. A fire truck is always red, just like you. <laughs> Thank you so much, Morphle and Chroma. <laughs> Hi, Cloud Monster. problems in the city already. Morphle and Chroma make a great team together. Chroma really likes coloring. It sure does. Hmm, I have an idea. Chroma, do you want a human companion that loves color? Amazing! 
You are the perfect magic pet for a painter like me. Accidentally dropped this life ray that I was going to present at the National Science Conference, and it zapped your toy dinosaurs to life. But it broke, and I can't zap the dinosaurs back again. Hmm. Mila, can you look after them while I fix my life ray? Of course, Professor Rashid. I'm sure we'll have lots of fun together. Great. I'll be back as soon as I can. Toy dinosaurs, while we wait for the professor to return, let's play a game! Longer than expected, but it's fixed now. Let's go back to the toy dinosaurs right away. I hope nothing bad has happened while I was gone. Oh, tumbling test tubes! Oh, 
Professor. Do you want to join the picnic? We've been having great fun. Thank you, Mila, but I think it's time to zap the dinosaurs back into toys. Steady. Oh. Professor Rashid, I don't think the toy dinosaurs want to go back to being toys. They've been having much more fun as living dinosaurs. Yes, Mila, but the city is no place for dinosaurs. Hmm. Oh, I have an idea. Maybe Zookeeper Kenneth has a place for them. What's this? Are those giant toy dinosaurs? Yeah, Professor Rashid accidentally zapped them with his life ray. Do you have a place for the toy dinosaurs to live, Zookeeper Kenneth? Well, the zoo only has one place for big animals, and the elephants already live there. But... During my travels, I think I spotted an uninhabited island where the toy dinosaurs could live. Let's go there right away, Morphle. There it is! again as well. Bye, toy dinosaurs! Apple. One for you, one for you. <laughs> hey, that's not nice. <laughs> What's wrong, Zookeeper Kenneth? I think I saw a green morphle. He sprayed water in my face when I was feeding the elephants. That sure sounds like Orful. We'll find him. Hey, elephants, do you know which way Orful went? Thank you. Let's go, Morphle. There, little guy. What are you doing over here? Hey! Are you okay, Builder Lawrence? Yes, yes, I'm fine. <laughs> Just don't let him get away with it. 
Should be here somewhere. give up that easily, did you? How about we try to play hide and seek without scaring anybody? Okay, you better hide because here we come. I've made you some lemonade. Lemonade! Whoa, whoa! Oops! Oh, um, I'll clean it up later. I really want to finish reading my book. you to go and do something else. Sure. Yeah. Sure. Ha <laughs> ha <laughs> I'm Professor Evil. Mr. Action is here to stop you. Morphopy Mr. Action? Um, sure. I have built a machine that will make everyone fall asleep. <laughs> oh no! Miss Action, stop you! <laughs> <laughs> so exciting! Ooh. Hmm, let's get this out of the way. Okay, <sighs> now where was I? You haven't won, Mr. Action. With the help of... Where has the chest gone? Mr. Action! Hmm. Why did you take away the chest? Morpho, no take a chest! Ah! Oh, you Mila build it again! I did not break your silly building. Uh, build it now, silly! Mila silly! You know what? I'm going to play without you. No, more for play without Mila. <laughs> more for play, no Mila. Wish. No Mila, no fun. What to draw? Oh, Morpha would think of something. 
That was a great book. Mofo, oh, sorry. I shouldn't have gotten so mad at you for breaking the crayon on my drawing. Huh? Oh, that was Morphle. I did that by accident. What? Oh, did you also break Morphle's block tower? Um, yeah. And take the toys away? Mmm, yup. And break a stick building? Uh, probably. Me love more for friends again? Of course. I'm sorry I did all those things, you two. And I'm sorry I caused you to fight. Can I stay your friend as well? <laughs> of course, Daddy. Yeah! Aww. turns, and it goes really high. The only problem is... You gotta be this tall to ride it. <laughs> hmm, I might know a certain professor who could help us with that. This will change you into a grown-up. But are you sure you want to do this, Mila? Absolutely. Well then, here it goes. Oh, Mila, so big! <laughs> Mila, is that you? Oh no, I'm Mila's aunt. <laughs> Wow, you look so similar. Anyways, you're tall enough. Enjoy the ride! Yay! Yay! Woohoo! Yeah! Wee ha ha ha! How was it? It was awesome! And now that I'm grown up, I can do anything I want! Grown up? Come, Morphle! wants to ride the dolphin. Me, 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 me. I do. I'm sorry, miss, but you are way too big to ride this dolphin. Aww. Let's pretend to be a teacher, Morphle. I'm sorry, miss, but you're not allowed inside. I'm Mila's aunt. Ah, I heard you were in town. Nice to meet you. Uh, but Mila isn't here, and I have to get back to class now. Goodbye. <sighs> Being an adult is starting to become very boring. This is a children's playground, miss. I'm going to have to find you. Oh, I'm sorry, but I cannot pay this. I don't have any money. Then I suggest you get a job. That's it. I don't want to be a grown-up anymore. Are you sure you want to be a little kid again? I've never been so sure in my life. Don't you want to become big again to ride it? 
No way! Being a grown-up was not as much fun as I thought. I'm going to enjoy being a little kid for as long as I can. Tag, you're right. <laughs> oh, get back here. Keeper Kenneth, what's wrong? Oh, the monkeys are missing. They always get into trouble, and I'm really worried about them. Hmm, we can find them. Yeah! Really? That's great! Morpho, morph into a helicopter. Could those monkeys be? Morpho, no, no! Ah, a monkey? I guess we found the first monkey. <laughs> but where is it? It's right there on the ceiling. Change the monkey's gravity. Yup. And now it wants to stay on the ceiling. Morphle can catch it. Yeah. You did it. Great. Do you know where the other monkeys could have gone to? Are you sure one monkey is out at sea? Oh, monkey! Oh no, a shark! to scare the shark away. And I have an idea. <laughs> Don't worry, monkey. to find the third monkey. Monkey! <laughs> Hi, Cloud Monster and Monkey. Oh, hello. I made a new friend. That's great. But we need to take the monkey and his friends back to the zoo. Oh, okay. But you can play with all three of them in the zoo. Really? <sighs> We're back, and we brought a friend. Great, there you are. <laughs> Look, Morphle, like this. <laughs> Morphle too! Morphle too! Don't worry, Morphle. You'll get the hang of it. But you'll never be as good as this little guy. Meet Boba, our newest magic pet. Boba loves blowing bubbles. He tends to bubble over with joy from it. <laughs> Whoa! See? 
That looks like fun. Oh, ah. Whee! <laughs> um, Boba, this is high enough. To something big. Ah! Big trap! <laughs> now, Morpho, save Mila! Mila! Uh oh! What is. <laughs> ah! Help! Help me! of problems. Oh, not in my city. Daddy! Morphle! Can you pop my bubble? Phew! Thanks, Morphle. You see me late? I think uh, she went that way? whether I'd see my car again. <laughs> well, Boba, next time you bubble over, please don't take it so literally. <laughs> huh? a youth serum, which I will demonstrate on my assistant. Oh, that's so cute! Puppy! Tumbling test tubes, Morphle! <laughs> I don't know how to take care of a baby! Oh, oh dear! Morphle! You have to take her to her daddy while I make an antidote. Oh, good grief. Morpho? Uh-oh, uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. no cry. 
I mean, the story. <laughs> Too bad about the flowers. Next up to tell about her weekend, Mila! Yay! My weekend began very peacefully. I was playing with Morphle when suddenly... Mila, it's terrible. Asteroids are about to hit the city, and we need you to stop them. Sounds like trouble. Morphle, morph into a giant robot. You super mega punch! Hey! Super mega kick! Hey! Now, super mega cartwheel! Morphle, you're my hero. And mine. That's awesome. Morphle is so cool. Sure sounds like an exciting weekend, Mila. Who's next? Oh, I'm just getting started. Oh, Mila, the bandits have a huge dragon. There's no way I can arrest him now. Morphle, morph into a robot again. Let's warm them up a little. Use the Super Ultra Heat Shield, Morphle. No way! No, you dumb dragon! My hero. It just keeps getting better. Are you sure it happened that way, Mila? You bet! And I'm not done yet! And that heat shield! Amazing! That dragon is probably still cowering in a cave somewhere. Hey, wait! That's my car! Morphle? Robot! Save it, Morphle. 
colorful super mega car smash. I'm sorry, Mila, but purple space bunnies, really? Well, that's what I saw. Recess, children. Oh, God, kids these days. Such lively imaginations. Oh, dear. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Are you ready to come travel back in time with us? We're going to visit the age of the dinosaurs. Ooh, dinosaurs. There are all sorts of different dinosaurs, and we are going to study them all. Let's go. Here we are, the age of dinosaurs. Look! Oh no! Those are velociraptors! Velociraptors are small but dangerous dinosaurs. Whoa! Tumbling test tubes! Whew, that was close. Thank you, Morph. Morph, morph into a Gallimimus. Wow! A Gallimimus is one of the fastest dinosaurs there is. Great, Morpho! Look over there. Those are Argentinosauruses. They are so big, but they only eat plants. <laughs> oh no, we need to save that egg, Morpho. Morph into a Pteranodon. Now, we need to find the mother of this egg. Hmm. It doesn't look like an Argentinosaurus egg. No. Look. There are some Argentinosaurus eggs right there. Let's keep searching. A Triceratops. Triceratops have three big, sharp horns. Oh, that's so cute. But look, those eggs are different from the egg we have. So this egg isn't a Triceratops egg. Interesting. A real Pteranodon. And it's trying to chase us away from her eggs. And look, those Pteranodon eggs don't look like the one we have. Let's fly away quickly. Those are Ankylosauruses. They can use the end of their tails to hit really hard. But look at that eggshell. It's different from ours as well. Huh? How can there be crocodiles? 
crocodiles in the time of the dinosaurs. Crocodiles are a really old species and already existed in the time of the dinosaurs. Wow! But look, even the crocodile eggs look different from ours. Oh, I don't think we're ever going to find the mother of this egg. Wants to eat us. Run! Morphle, morph into a T Rex. A Spinosaur is way bigger than a T Rex. wants to eat us, but what does it want? I know, it wants the egg. The Spinosaurus is the mother of this egg. Phew, that was close. Good thinking, Mila. present. Thank you, Daddy. Look, Morphle. Daddy gave me a balloon for my birthday. <laughs> oh! Oh, no! The wind swept away my birthday present. Let's go after it, Morphle. Take your binoculars, Mila. Thanks, Daddy. Bye. Bye. Hmm. Ah. Oh. Hi! 
Oh, hello. I lost my hat somewhere around here, but where? Very much. No problem. Good luck finding your balloon. Bye bye. Oh! oh. Wow! It's a cloud castle. Finally, someone at my party. Um, Mr. Cloud? Can I have that balloon, please? It was my birthday present. Your birthday present? I thought somebody must have sent it to me for my birthday. It's your birthday, too? Thanks. <sighs> Poor thing. There is no one at his party. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? <sighs> Everybody. Happy birthday, Mr. Cloud. Happy birthday, Mila. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, warm. Right. We're off to the beach. Magic Pets, take good care of the store while we're gone. Bye-bye, everyone. <laughs> right. On to business, Yawn. Mm. Have you tried it, Stan? It's pretty good. Bothering you? Yes, terribly. Uh, how nice of you to ask. Blaster yawn! Much better, right? <laughs> Last one in the water is a pickle! <laughs> oh! Ugh. How did this ice get here? No need to thank us. Enjoy! <laughs> Don't worry, Daddy. We're going to stop them. Mm -hmm. Morph into a giant lion morphle. And 
Now to finish it off. Oh no, Morpho! <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, Morpho. I'll get you out of there. <laughs> so, they got Morpho too, huh? Daddy, you're free! <laughs> yeah, we're lucky the sun is so hot today. Now, let's get Morpho out of there. Mm -hmm. Yay! Now morph into a monster truck. But with spikes on its wheels, so we don't lose any grip on the ice. Some ice cream. There you go, fellows. As you ordered, lots and lots of robots. Perfect. I'm so glad you liked your previous ones, but what do you need all of these for, if I might ask? Nothing, Professor. And please just keep building more for us. Mila, I want my toy car back. Toy car? I don't have your toy car, Troy. Yes, you do. I saw you take it. If you don't give it back, I'm going to tell your dad. Mila, I now have a toy car. Fine, have it your way. Troy, wait! There you are, Mila. I was on my way to a very important meeting when you threw mud at me. But I would never do that. I have to go home and get changed, but I'm not done with you, young lady. This is crazy, Morpho. We need to find out what's going on. Morph into a helicopter. Morpho, look! That's not me. I'm right here. Oh. <laughs> it must be a robot. Go after it, Morpho. Morph a magnet. Let's take it to jail. Officer Freeze will know what to do. Officer Freeze, we've caught a robot causing mischief. You mean, like this one? Huh? What? How many are there? Professor, we need more robots. I'm working as fast as I can. I'm sure the robots went this way. Get us some ice cream. Okay. We need to get that remote more full. 
I have an idea. Follow me. Look, it's Morpho. Morpho? Morpho. 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 Grab him. Where are you going, little robot? What the? All robots, catch the bandits! No! No! Ah! Of course you were behind it all. <laughs> it's really cramped up here, Stein. Scoot over, robot. No! No! no. Morpho! Catch the bandits! Ice cream. Catch the bandits! Catch the bandits! Oh, I mean... Ice cream! No! Watch out, dudes! Sharks in the water! Morpho! We have to tell those sharks that they shouldn't scare people. Morph into a shark. Sharka, stop scaring people! What are they doing? Job, Morpho. But look, those sharks are still scaring away people. We need to help him, Morpho. Stop it, you sharks. Robot sharks? Sharks must have scared away all the people from the beach. <laughs> yeah, so now we can steal all of their towels. I can't believe Professor Rashid fell for it. The idea that we actually wanted these robots in order to research sharks. And that he made them in exchange for just one egg sandwich. <laughs> Speaking of which, where are our robot sharks? Look out, Morpho! Bandit! Not those two again. Morpho, become a big shark, too. <laughs> You're no match for our robot. Let's get him, Yorn. Now more flags, more full. Oh, 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 Look, 
dying. Our robot sharks have come to save us. Those are not robot sharks, Yorn. Those are real sharks. Help! Help! You've learned an important lesson today. Yeah, real sharks are dangerous. So we shouldn't scare people while dressed like sharks? Exactly. Superhero? Ha! Ah, okay, Mila, superhero. <laughs> I don't have any superpowers, silly Morphle. Morphle, do? Wow, Mila, superhero. Wow, thank you, Morphle. <laughs> Come back, Bella! Mila, the superhero, will get Bella back for you! Mila the superhero. Stop it, please. <laughs> Mila the superhero will stop your truck. Don't you worry. Thank you, Mila. My ice cream truck. Thank you so much, Mila the superhero. Don't mention it, sir. That's what superheroes do. Mila, look! One more time, Yon. Okay, Stein. Cut the way, Yorn. But we're stuck. It is so happy. Yeah. Thank you, Mila, the superhero. Yeah! Superheroes help people, but do you know what they do as well? No, what do they do? They put bandits in jail. <laughs> oh. And 
Volcanic Joe are wrecking the city. Why would they do that? Not in my city. Zap him with the Hypno Ray, Yorn. Follow us. Yes, sir. Morphle, morph into a giant robot. Stop Lawrence and Joe from wrecking the city, Morphle. <laughs> no, Morpha. Help them wreck the city. Okay, Mr. Bandit. Oh, no. Morpha turns evil. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> because of this hypno ray, everybody will have to do what we say. But how can we stop them when Morphle doesn't do what you say? <sighs> okay, here we go, Bandit Yorn. I'm sure it will work, Stein. Mom! There are two people here that want to tell you something. <sighs> if it isn't my good-for-nothing sons, I don't have time for the two of you right now. The president isn't going to blackmail himself. Tell her! Tell her! Your sons are the greatest baddies that I have ever seen in my city. They are truly bad baddies. What are you talking about? My sons have never been real baddies, and now they've even brought a cop to my house. Why, I, you two are even worse baddies than I thought. But... Mom, tell us that we are great baddies. Yes, tell us you are proud of us. Stop it, bandits. Why should we? You are just a little girl without your red blob. Everybody, grab them. Huh? Why are these people following your orders? Did you hypnotize them? People shouldn't do what you say because you force them. They should do what you say because they agree with you. And for wrecking the city, you two are going to jail. My sons are getting arrested? Yes, Mom. We get arrested all the time. Oh. Boys, the two of you are real baddies after all. <laughs> I'm so proud of you guys. Did you hear that, Stein? Yes, I did, Yorn. Yes, I did. The city looks perfect again, but come on, guys. It's time for bed now. No, Daddy. We don't want to go to bed. And you should only do what people say if you agree with them. <laughs> That's true. But little kids do what their daddies say. <laughs> Just daddies? And mommies. And school teachers. And the police officer. And grandmas and grandpas. Uh, let's see, and... Thanks for coming with me to the doctor, Morphle. Even though it might be a little boring. Morphle like doctor! That's good to hear. Now, if you could take a seat right here. 
Is your sight better or worse? Worse. And now? Better. And now? It's the same. All done. Mother wanna test you. All right then. How well can you see, Morphle? No good. And now? Uh... How about now? Yeah, yeah, Morphle she good. As I expected, I'll print out the results for you. Be sure not to mix them up, Morphle. Ooh, bye bye. Hey, wait up, Morphle. See you next time, Doctor. Bye now. Now, let me see that test result of mine, Morphle. Oh, wow! It says here, I don't need glasses anymore. Now let me see your test, Morphle. Oh, dear. It looks like you need my glasses. Let's get them adjusted so they will fit you. Are you happy with your glasses, Morphle? Yeah, Morphle happy, but Morphle see bad. Me too, but I'm sure the doctor knows best. I think our eyes just need a little time to adjust. In the meantime, why don't we go play at the beach? Hmm, people are not very friendly today. Wow, it's a great day at the beach. These are the best waves I've ever seen. But all that surfing made me hungry. Let's get some ice cream. Refreshing. Mmm. Let me see if it's time to pick up Mila from school. I think we still have time to feed the magic pets back at the store, Morphle. I think it's time we call your dad. I can't believe they forgot about me. I need to feed Brother Time. Could you hand me that magic pet food, Morphle? What are you doing? Are you blind? Far from it. We just had our eyes checked, Police Officer Freeze. I'm not Police Officer Freeze. I'm Zookeeper Kenneth. You can it! Anyway, Morphle needs glasses now, and I don't. Hey! See? You need glasses, and Morphle doesn't. Hey! This isn't the magic pet shop. Oh no. We must have mixed up the test results. And look at the time. We need to pick up Mila from school, Morphle. Oh, Mila! Those guys. I'm glad they have Mila who can keep an eye on them. You're being very thorough, Police Officer Freeze. I have to be. Two police commissioners will drop by to see if I'm doing a good job as a police officer. Everything has to be perfect. Well, then we won't keep you. Good luck. Bye-bye. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Why are you not wearing your official cleaning hat? No cleaning hat. Cleaning hat? Uh, sorry, uh, you must be the commissioners. Uh, welcome. A good police officer has to know all the laws. Yes, I, I believe I do, sir. We'll see about that. <laughs> oh, a red light. Why aren't you singing? Singing? 
A police officer at the red light should be singing. Uh, uh, look at me, uh, the happy policeman. Too late. Another law I didn't know. No eating while on duty. So many tickets. I'm afraid we're going to have to take you to jail. Why would they arrest him? Morph into a race car. Hey, Meland Morphle. What happened to you? As it turns out, I don't know half the laws. I'm not fit to be a police officer. That can't be right. We need to get to the bottom of this, Morphle. No hats in the park! Morph into a bush! No picnics with a blanket, or near a tree, or with a basket! With Peter Freeze gone, we can do anything, Yorn. <laughs> yeah, Stein. Bandits! So, they made up all those strange laws. Two can play at that game. Oops, sorry. You will be sorry once I find... Uh, where is it? Let me see. Uh, see oh, no, not, not that one. Uh, uh, it? Oh, ah, here it is. When a person bumps into the police commissioners, the police commissioners should keep walking. Uh, okay. Come on, Yorn. They have to leave their bag of loot at the door of the police station and go inside. They now have to take off their fake mustaches and call out, We're the bandits! Uh, wait, this doesn't make any sense. It does to me. You're under arrest. is really difficult. There's no way you can do that. I think we can do it, Mr. Vanderboos. You'll see. Huh. Now, first we need to make sure all the planks are the right lengths. Hmm. I don't think scissors are going to be strong enough. Morphle, morph into a saw. <laughs> Now let's put them together. <laughs> Look at these amateurs, Barky. I think we need some nails for that. Morphle, morph into a hammer. That 
that looks nothing like a tree house. It hasn't even got a roof. Well, that is not half bad, I suppose. And now, let's turn it into a real tree house. Morphle, morph into a... It's actually a decent tree house. Halt! What is the password? Uh, I'm Morpho now. now. <laughs> the password is Morpho. Morpho. Yay! <laughs> Yay! That is the most beautiful tree house. I have ever seen. Come on, Morple. Let's go get April and Troy and have a party in our new clubhouse. What's the password? Huh? The password is Morple. Wrong. That's the password for your club. If you don't know the password for my club, well, you can't enter. Hmm. Well, then our club will have a picnic on the grass instead of a party in the clubhouse. Hey there, Barky. Do you want to join our club? Um, can I... can I join your club, too? Of course, Mr. Vanderboos. That's great! Then why don't we have a party in our clubhouse? Mr. Mirror, can you show us what's happening in the mirror world? I most certainly can, Mila. Morphle, love Mirabel! Orful! <laughs> no, 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 Morphle. Put him back inside me. That's awful. In the mirror world, everything is the opposite of what it's like in our world. And since Morphle is very friendly, I am afraid that Orful will want to do nothing but bad things. Good thinking. We can't have Orful running around in the city creating a mess. Come, Morphle, let's play with Krama for a while. Hello, Morphle. How are you today? Oh, police officer nice. Whoa! What are you doing? <laughs> Morphle! You can't just leave me here! Sounds like someone's looking for you, Morphle. There you are, Morphle. Now get me back down from here. Thanks, but I don't appreciate these kind of shenanigans. Shenanigans? It was you who put me on the roof in the first place. But Morphle was inside with us the whole time. No, he put me on the roof, and he was laughing about it, like this. <laughs> oh, no, that sounds like Orful. Mr. 
Mr. Mirror. Show us the mirror world, please. Oh, no. Orful has escaped. Oh, dear. We need to find him, you guys. Doing, Morphle? Are you building something? Hey, what's the deal here? This isn't fun, Morphle. There you are. This joke has lasted long enough. Put everything back, please, Morphle. But, but Morphle did no do. We must be getting close. Morph into a race car. What about my car? Morphle, put us back on the ground. But if that's Morphle, who's that? We need to make sure Orful can't pretend to be Morful anymore. Chroma, paint Orful green. Orful green? Hold up, Morful. Let's help Troy and April down first. I hope we have seen the last of Orful. <laughs> well, hello, Mila and Morphle. What are you two up to today? We're playing with Morphle's favorite toy, <gasps> Mr. Action. <laughs> Mr. Action is really great. Always helps people in need. Except for the bad guys, of course, like Professor Evil. Oh, wow! How about we zap him to life so he can really help the people in the city? Mr. Action, you? Oh, <laughs> put it on the ground, Morphle. I am Mr. Action! <laughs> Professor Evil, my enemy. Hand over that device! Oh! Mm. All right. Well, that was easy. Oh, no! Time to help the city fall! Mr. Action! We have to get that life ray back, Morphle! Quickly, morph into a superhero, too! This calls for action. Don't worry, ma'am. I've got this. Get out of here! Catch it, Morphle! Leave this woman alone! Thank you, Morphle. <laughs> and 
you're the worst! I'll take that, boys. That definitely calls for some action. Wait, what? Here you go, honest citizens. Uh, but those are the bad guys. Lying never pays, Peter Freeze. <laughs> Why are you holding Professor Evil? Are you his henchman? No, no, no. This is Professor Evil. Professor Evil is a toy, just like you used to be, Mr. Action. This is Professor Rashid, and he shouldn't be a toy. Oh, no. Thank you for your explanation, tiny blueberry girl. Yeah. Tumbling test tubes! Oh. But how can I fight Professor Evil now? I must become a toy again myself! <laughs> no one can stop me now! Oh, no! <laughs> What's the hold-up? You've caught us already. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll be there in a minute. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Look at him. Look, look. <laughs> And my magic pet, Morphle, can morph into anything I want. Hi, everyone. We are going to take a look at different feelings. Morphle, what was the last time when you felt really happy? Really happy when he had that ice cream. And what was the last time you felt scared? <laughs> we are the ice cream bandits. We steal all the ice cream. Yeah! when the bandits came to steal your ice cream. And then your ice cream fell on the ground. That must have made you feel very sad. Morpho sad. The next feeling is anger. Morpho is very angry. Yeah, you got angry, B. 
because the bandits ruined your ice cream. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> hey, Mila and Morphle. There is one feeling you didn't cover. Surprise! <laughs> Ice cream! <laughs> <laughs> Those kids are so loud. Is that Orphan? Do you want to help me play some pranks on Mila and Morphle? Yeah! <laughs> now, Orphal. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Jump on top of their sand castle. Yeah. <laughs> no more Oh no! I know Mr. Vanderboos helps you to prank us. But how would you like to help us prank him for once? Mr. Vanderboos. Uh, hi, Mila. I'm sorry for being so loud, Mr. Vanderboos. We will never do so again. Oh, uh, that's all right. I guess I can go back to watering my yard. That's strange. Ah! Now I'm all wet. Ah! Ugh. Ugh. What is going on? What? Where did you come from? No! Stop growing! Now my backyard looks like a jungle! A tiger! It really is a jungle! Don't worry, Morphle. 
I think it's almost time for Brother Time to zap us back to our own time. Look! We're back! Yay! Thank you, Brother Time. Using your magic pet powers, we went to the past and saw lots of dinosaurs. Yay! Thank you! Did you hear that yawn? Yeah, they saw a lot of dinosaurs. Yes, and they had a lot of fun. <sighs> This means we can go to the past as well. Oh, good idea, Stein. And in the past, we can gather dinosaurs to create our own dino army. Wow! I always wanted to be a general, Stein. <laughs> What's that? <gasps> oh, no! Stop it, Bandit! We need to follow them, Morphle. <laughs> Keep up, Yon. <laughs> uh oh, I can't see them anymore. Morphle cannot, too. <gasps> I know. Morphle, morph into a search dog. Look, Yon. They are so cute and little. They will be the first members of our dino army. I don't think they want to join us, Stein. Come on, guys. It's going to be great. <laughs> bandits! Oh, no. The bandits are in trouble. Morphle, morph into a Gallimimus so we can catch up with them. Yay! Now morph into a T-Rex to scare the Velociraptors away. of the dinosaurs is very dangerous. It really is, Stein. I guess you're... Oh, dinosaur! Oh, no! A pteranodon has taken the bandit. Morphle, morph into a pterodactyl. Do a triceratops so you can pin down its tail. Phew. Thank you. Ah, uh, Stein, behind you. Uh oh. Help us. <laughs> Can't you morph into something? <laughs> Tricycle! Oh, no! I have an idea. Morphle, morph into a big Argentinosaurus. Woo! We're safe here. Great. I love you, Morphle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Now we only have to wait until Brother Time's hourglass runs out of sand and we will be sent back to our own time. Look! We're back! Yeah! Uh, <clears throat> maybe the dino army wasn't such a good plan after all. Mila, Morphle, look at this new toy I got. Oh. Ah. Huh? 
<laughs> oh no! The magic letters are gone! I had every letter of the alphabet in my trunk. Is that one of them, Daddy? Ah, yes. It's the T for tree. Look over there, in that yellow car. The C for car, and the Y for yellow. Here, everything you catch with this Magic Pet Transporter Hoop will end up in the Magic Pet Store. The two of you catch all of the letters for me, Mila? Of course, Daddy. Let's start with the A, Morphle. A, A, uh, airplane. That's right. Let's find an airplane.
say, are you looking for this little guy? The U for UFO. I was on my way to Professor Rashid, but I got lost. Don't worry, we'll get you there. No, tumbling test tubes. Look, it's the L for laboratory. Hmm, maybe that also explains why there is a Q in my quantum physics experiment. brings you to the zoo. We're looking for all the magic letter pets. And we only need the Z for zoo. Well, it sounds like your friends are waiting for you. <laughs> oh, Mila and Morphle. Firefighters! They are real heroes! Wow! Let's become real firefighters ourselves, Morphle! Find a fire. I don't see any fires. But I do see smoke. <gasps> and where there's smoke, there's fire. What have you done? Oh, now the barbecue is ruined. Sorry. Why don't you go play firefighter somewhere else? <gasps> we need to help him off the roof. Builder Lawrence, you're not stuck on the roof anymore. Stuck? I was working on the roof building a chimney. Uh-oh. Uh, 
I have heard about a fire truck that's not helping people. Is it you? Just leave the firefighting to real firefighters, okay? Ah, Mila, Morful, there you are. The city needs your help. Firefighter Gerben was saving a kitten out of the flames when he got trapped on the roof. Oh, no! Morph into a fire truck again. Thank you, Morphle. Now you can put out the flames. You saved me. I was wrong about you. You are a real firefighter. Yeah! <laughs> Yippee! I have to go do something, Morphle. But it's a secret, so you can't come. Huh? Morphle, come too! No, Morphle. It's not allowed. Bye bye Morphle. Oh, what's up, Morphle? Uh, Daddy, no, where's Mila? Hmm, no, sorry, Morphle. <coughs> Mila! 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 What's wrong, Morphle? Mila here. No, sorry. I haven't seen her today. <laughs> Me Mila here? What? No, Mila's not here. <laughs> She's not here. <laughs> Mila not here? <laughs> no, Morphle. Where is Mila? Where Morphle Mila? crying? Not in my city. Come on, Morphle. I'll bet Mila's waiting for you at home. <laughs> Not so fast, Morphle. You haven't checked the backyard yet. Now open your present. Yeah! Justice never sleeps. But you have to from 9 to 7. It's crime fighting time! Right after you brush your teeth. Hey, Mila and Morphle. The two of you have got a call. Oh, who is it? It is I! <laughs> the Ice Cream Man. I have found a new yummy flavor of ice cream. But I'm on the other side of the world. And 
There's only a little bit left. Oh, no! Don't worry, Mr. Ice Cream Man. We'll come to you. <laughs> it's awful! If he gets to the Ice Cream Man first, he will eat all the ice cream. No! Was that another morphle? Oh no, my car! How will I catch criminals without my police car? We need to help Police Officer Freeze get his car back, Morphle. Ah, <laughs> oh, thank you, Mila and Mor Huh? <laughs> I don't think Orphle knows what's fastest on the water. But I do! Morph into a speedboat. Now, morph into a monkey. A race car isn't fast in the jungle, Orful. Morphle? Oh no, it's Orful! Sounds like Orful got there first. <laughs> you ate all of my ice cream! Oh no! <laughs> We're too late, Morphle. <laughs> Don't worry. I only acted like he ate all the ice cream, so he would go away. There is more than enough ice cream for you, you, Mr. A Monkey, and even for me. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Ice Cream Man. Let's read a fairy tale, Morphle. Okay. Once upon a time, Mila and Morphle were walking through a forest, and inside that forest, they saw a house made of candy. Wow! They were really hungry and wanted to eat the house. Mm -mm. Oh no! What is happening? Mila, Jack! But I don't want to be so big. Let's go look for a cure to make me small again. Yeah! Roar! Ah, a dragon! Hi, Mila and Morphle. 
What are you doing? I got turned into a giant, and now we're looking for a cure to make me small again. That's awesome. Troy the dragon will help you. <laughs> the dragon helps them? This is a very silly fairy tale. You know, I hear they can cure anything in that castle over there. Great! Let's go there! Oh, no, you don't! I'm a pirate! Yar! And there's a bounty on giants! Oh, no! I'll protect you, Giant Mila! way too easy. What your fairy tale needs is an evil wizard. <laughs> Only by defeating me can Mila become small again. Oh no, it's the evil wizard. You can never defeat me. We'll see about that. <laughs> Send it right back to you. Ouch! That hurts! I'll stop him. And you can't fly if your balloon is leaking. Whoa! Whoa! Ah! Ruffle, Ruffin, Grab, Wizard! I'll create a portal so you won't even get close. Ah! Evil wizard! Um, would anyone like a cookie? Cookies! Mm. Uh, why, thank you. Oh, I have an idea. The evil wizard can't say what he does to stop us with his mouth full. But what? Mila the giant grabs the evil wizard so he can escape. I'll shoot him with my cannon. Yeah, and I'll use my fire. Muffo, I need to beat him. we do next? Oh, no. They say there's a monster hiding in these woods. First, you will hear a growl. Then, you will see all kinds of spooky shadows. And then, the monster will come out and... Get you! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, April, you're so good at telling spooky stories. That story can't be true. Monsters aren't real. Nuh-uh, it is true. Sarah told me so herself. And how would Sarah even... Uh, quiet, everyone. Did you hear that? It's the monster! No way! It must be the wind or something. Hmm. If you're so sure, why don't you check it out? Mm -hmm. Fine. I'm not scared. The sounds came from this direction, right? There, in the bushes. Won't you check it out? Uh, okay. Ah! Oh, that's not a 
monster. It's a rabbit. Phew. <laughs> I knew that. I just wanted to scare you guys. Sure. But we still don't know where that scary noise came from. Ah! <gasps> Did you see that shadow? It could have been another rabbit, right? I don't think there are rabbits that big. Again? Why me? You said it was just the wind, right? Prove it. The shadow went that way. You can do it, Troy. All right, fine. Let's go. <laughs> well, I don't see any monster. Me neither. But now we still don't know where that scary sound came from. Just admit that monsters aren't real. Ah! Troy! Behind you! There's no such thing as mon... Monster! <gasps> it's real! <gasps> Run away! <laughs> uh -oh! You're not or <gasps> Wait! You mean Orful's the monster? So there is no real monster? Oh, that Orful. That's so mean. Hmm. Let's see how he likes getting scared. <laughs> it's really strange. Teacher Arnold hasn't come back after break. Yay, let's go! <laughs> no, Morphle. Let's go find him. Morph into a race car. It's Arnold! What happened? <laughs> Don't worry, we'll find a way to get you out of there. Yeah! <laughs> Look, there's Mr. Vanderboot. <laughs> huh. Daddy! <gasps> Daddy! We'll get you out. Just wait a bit longer. Okay, that way, Morphle. We've almost got it, Yon. Yeah. Bandit! We need to help Atmo. Morphle, morph rockets to the car. Almost. Gotcha. You did it, Stein! Wow! It was Atmo that froze Daddy in the rest. It has a cold. Atmo, here! You need to go to the doctor, Atmo. He can help you get better. Morphle, morph into an ambulance. Whoa, what's going on? Atmo has a cold, and when he sneezes, he freezes everything in front of him. Hmm, I think I have some medicine just for that. Whoa! 
Uh-oh. Um, we'll just need to find the right medicine. Is it this one? Okay, how about this one? How about this one? No, uh, this... Okay, this one? No? Well, there is only one bottle left. Do you think you can make the sun shine again so that all the ice melts again? Again, I knew you three could solve this problem. Whew, now let's go home. Whew, I could use a hot chocolate. Yeah, chocolate! <laughs> uh, I think I caught a cold. Huh? Oh no! Huh? Ugh! <laughs> uh. cute little fella. It's so funny to think that one day you will be big and scary. <laughs> <laughs> With this sapper that we stole from Professor Racine, we can turn these animals into giants. <laughs> Going to have a great day at the zoo, Morphle. Yeah! Mila, Morphle, the bandits are zapping all the animals into giants. Oh no! We need to get the zapper back. Morphle, morph into a superhero. <laughs> You're zapped in. Uh oh, we didn't think that went through. We'll be back. No. Great. Now let's zap back all the animals. There, it's the penguin. Lion. <laughs> 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 
Ce nom est mon Keeper Kenneth, we're back! Great! But... Huh? Oh no! You have become really small. But you're still great animals. <laughs> ah, there's a crocodile in my apples! Oh no! You get the award for... Let's water this beautiful garden of ours, Barky. Hmm. Wait a second. This isn't a garden hose. It's a... Snake! <laughs> we are now the Scary Animal Bandits. We steal scary animals and release them in the city. But Stein, I thought we were... Shh! Release the tiger! Ah! Help! Oh no! We need to help them, Morpho. Morpho? Morpho no can help. Tiger scary. The tiger is scary for me too, Morpho. It is very dangerous. But you don't need to be afraid of the tiger because you can morph into something big. So the tiger is scared of you instead. Yeah. I know just what would scare a tiger. Look! A big T-Rex! Of course, but you should still do it, because if you do something a lot, you won't be scared anymore. <laughs> Yay! Now let's scare all the other animals out of the city. <laughs> These scary animals are making sure everyone in the city stays inside so that we can execute our real plan. Yeah, <laughs> we are actually the fruit bandits. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. So if we eat all the fruit in the city, we don't ever have to go to the doctor again. Ooh, and the doctor is really scary. Ooh. We need to stop them. Morph into a big crocodile. <laughs> a big, dangerous crocodile! Bandits, you don't need to steal all that fruit. I used to be scared of the doctor, but I went anyway. And now, I'm not scared of the doctor at all. Because if you do something a lot, you won't be scared anymore. Really? Hello, there you are. Please follow me inside. Here's 
not scary at all, Stein. I wonder how the toy dinosaurs are doing, Morphle. Morph into a pterodactyl. Great! You are here to save me! I'm stuck on this island, and it's filled with... giant monsters! <laughs> Those aren't monsters! They're the toy dinosaurs! No, wait! It will eat you! They're not scary! They are my toys! Professor Rashid's light ray zap them to life! Wow! Really? Morphle, morph into a T-Rex, too! This is amazing! Now, let's play! Hi, Mila and Morphle. Thank you for getting rid of the snow. The snow was made by Atmo, a new magic pet. It can control the weather, but uh, it's a bit naughty. Huh? Atmo is gone! And he's making a storm. We need to find it before its mischief gets out of hand. Oh no! I think it went that way. Let's go! path is blocked. Not in my city!
Atmo, you need to stop the storm. It must not be able to hear me through the storm. Atmo, you need to. Oh, oh no! Atmo, I know you like playing with the weather, but that was dangerous. Mila and Morphle, what do you think of our new dinosaur park? Dinosaur park? Yes. Professor Rashid and I have transported these dinosaurs to our time. Because everybody likes dinosaurs. Am I right, little buddy? You bet. Isn't this dangerous? Nonsense. These are harmless. They don't eat people. Well, that's good. Now, this T-Rex, on the other hand... This doesn't seem very safe. Don't worry. This is the strongest cage in the world. Just don't touch this lever. It controls the door. See? Ah, oh, the lever is stuck. Everybody run! Quickly, Morphle! Morph into a T-Rex as well! Back to the past! Mila, two of the dinosaurs have escaped into the city. If you bring them here, I can send them back to the past as well. All right, let's go, Morphle. Morph into a helicopter. Please stop! This is not a tree! Hmm, it must be hungry! I think we can lure it with a snack! Morph into a robot! Pick up that tree, Morphle! Phew! Huh? Something is happening outside. 
inside the park. Move over, buddy. But not as strong as you, Morphu. Morph into a bulldozer. Hey, you! Now scoop him up, Morphu. Thank you, Mila and Morphle. Without you, we would have been in quite a pickle. Outstanding work. But what to do with the park? It looks a little boring without dinosaurs. Well, how about you organize a picnic? Hmm, yes, a picnic. With dinosaurs. Our time portals. Tumbling test tubes. How did this happen? These items don't belong here. Someone must be looking for them. We should bring them back to their own time. What a good idea, Mila. This little machine is looking really high-tech. Yeah, it must be from the future. You're right. Let's go there then. First stop, the future. Yeah! <laughs> Wait a minute. Hmm. This doesn't look like the future. <laughs> to a pterodactyl. Oh, thank you so much for saving me, fellow time travelers. You won't believe what happened. I was just researching these grounds when suddenly my time remote was gone. Is this yours, perhaps? Oh, yes! Thank you very much. Oh, now I can get home. All right, keep your hands inside the vehicle. Next stop will be the medieval times. Yeah, let's bring back the sword. This doesn't look like the right time for a medieval sword. That's because this isn't the medieval times. What went wrong with this machine? That's it. That's my family's heirloom sword. They stole it! Family heirloom? 
We didn't steal it. We came to bring it back. That's what all thieves say. Policeman, arrest him! Oh, no! <sighs> well, at least the sword is back with its owner. But I don't understand why nothing works today. Don't beat yourself up, Professor. We only have one item left. That's true. Well, let's see where we end up now. The medieval times. Phew, finally. It was a bit of a detour, but we're here. But I wonder where the egg is from. Oh, 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 oh. Tumbling test tubes. Why is everybody running? Oh. Oh. You, you had the dragon's egg. Please, give it back to the dragon. Hurry! Oh, so that's a mommy dragon searching for her egg. We need to give it back, but how? Morphle, morph into a dragon too. You. Hey, you! Uh, who is this? Oh, is that you? So, you're the reason why everything went wrong today. Because of you, this mommy dragon almost lost her baby. Problems, but now everyone has their things back. Well, I sure hope Orphal has learned his lesson. Look, Morphle. <laughs> Tumbling test tubes, help! The Christmas present bandits used my time machine to steal a T-Rex from the past! <laughs> we are no longer the Christmas present bandits. Now, we are the Dino Bandits! Morphle, morph into a police car! <laughs> Not so tough now, eh? Now, this is our city! <laughs> well, boys, welcome back to my city. Hmm. 
I don't think this is quite big enough. Careful, Morphle. Telefox has the magic pet flu, so you'll need to keep your distance for a while. Whoa. Won't you get sick, Daddy? Only magic pets can get the magic pet flu. Telefox and I will stay inside to make sure other magic pets can't get the flu. No play? Don't worry. We can still have fun inside, right, Telefox? Look! I wonder how that happened. I think Chroma has the magic pet flu as well. Don't get too close, Morphle. Hi, Mr. Painter. Hi, Chroma. I think you have the magic pet flu, Chroma. So that's what it is. Chroma started sneezing right after a big bubble popped in front of her. You should stay inside until you get better so you won't make any other magic pets sick. We can still have fun at home. Think of all the paintings we can make. Hey, look, look! A big bubble. Let's see where it came from. Whoa! Lawrence, you should take Animi home. It has the magic pet flu. Oh, no. It must have gotten sick from one of those bubbles in the air. Let's go back home and get you better, Animi. Oh, bubble! Let's find out where those bubbles came from. Look, Morphle, it's Boba. Boba Bubbles. Boba, you need to go home and stay inside. I don't think Boba wants to go inside. Let's go after it, Morphle. Morphle, okay. Morphle, no shit. Eh, 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 ah! Uh-oh. Do you feel good enough to chase after Boba? Yeah! to get inside, Boba. When you're outside and sick, you're making lots of other magic pets sick as well, including Morphle. Achoo! And we can still have lots of fun at home. Right, Morphle? Yeah!
It's great you will always help everyone you can. stuck in the tree, and I miss holding him in my arms. Can you bring us together again? <laughs> I didn't mean together like this. <sighs> if you two hadn't stolen my police car, you would be in jail already. <laughs> we don't mind. <laughs> yeah. Morphal. Oh, it's great you're here. Can you help me bring these bandits to the police station? Hmm. Okay. Oh, no. What? Marvel, wait for me! Bandits to police station! Bye! <laughs> he didn't put us in jail, Stein. <laughs> yeah. Let's run away. <sighs> oh, hey, Morphle. Can you help me lift these crates? They're really heavy. <laughs> oh! No, Morphle. Not all the way to the roof. <laughs> there you are, Morphle. What happened? Your red friend put me in the tree and ran away. That can't be right. Morpho did not do. I know what I saw. Hm. Morpho, where did you leave the bandits? We haven't seen the bandits. I saw you taking them to the station, Morphle. Ugh, we'll catch the bandits again. Morphle, morph into a robot. Ah, oh, man. The joke has gone on long enough, Morphle. Please put the crates back down again. Morphle was with me all day, Daddy. Really? But he looked like Morphle and was red like Morphle. Apart from those green spots, of course. Green spots? Of course! It's Orful! We need to stop him, Morphle! Hi, Morphle. Can you help me make some room here? Look, Morphle! Orful has painted himself red! Oh, no! Let's clean him up, Morphle. Morph into a fire truck. Oh, careful, Morphle. That's not Morphle. It's Orful. Now, you won't be able to fool anyone anymore, Orful. Thank you, real Morphle. <laughs> Orful, be back. Hold it right there. Hi there, fire truck. Dump those losers and come with us. Hey! We need our truck to get to a fire! 
better start running then. <laughs> yes, we are now the vehicle bandit. And with this life ray, it's easier than ever. Oh no, Morpho. We've got to stop them. Morph into a race car. Wait, we need to put out a fire now. Morpho, morph into a fire truck. To the farm! No more trips for you, you Sunday driver! Why, you, you ruffians! Time to clean yourself up! <laughs> I don't know what happened. I was flipping burgers, and all of a sudden, a fire broke out. Let's go after those bandits, Morpho. Bandits! Wait, Mila, Morpho. Those bandits have stolen my ambulance, and I need to bring this lady to the hospital. Morph into an ambulance, Morpho. Ah, a quiet day in my city. No traffic violations anywhere. Huh? Cars without drivers? Oh, not in my city. Wait, what? Bye-bye. Now, let's get those bandits. <laughs> Stop it! Right there! Oh. Uh. Morpho, morph into a police car. Wow, it's like you read my mind. Let's get those baddies! Oh, no, you don't. Vehicles, stop them! Fly over them, Morpho. Uh-oh. Vehicles, join forces and become a mega robot! We are vehicle robots. Oh, boy. There's only one ride left for you, and that's a ride to jail. <laughs>